Yo, uh, what's up? I wanted to make a video about being an agnostic and atheist. Like, I believe there's no way to prove that there's God, but there's also no way to disprove it as well. So, it's a very interesting concept on life that you have to look at. I mean, I just look at it as if you're Christian and that makes you do good and make good deeds, then you should go that route. Or if you're Buddhist or you know Jewish, or but if you're agnostic and that makes you go the same positive good route, I guess in life you should do it. I mean. I am looking in, I don't know if you can see these, but I am looking in, I don't know, different, some other religions I've been looking at just when I was, I guess, born and raised Christian, I kind of renounced that faith when I was 10, and then, what, 10, well, yeah, pretty much not 10, but I would say 12, and then when I got to high school, I really was like, not, uh, it just doesn't make me happy, you know, I had to go through the whole, mom was trying to get me to go to church, and she actually said she would give me $50 once in church if I was going to get baptized again, I was like, no, I was like, I wanted the 50, but I was trying to hold my ground, so she would actually believe that I'm like, I'm not just going through some phase or anything. I'm 20 now, and I'm still from back when I was 13, so like seven years. I'm, yeah, seven years. Yeah, that sounds about right. I guess I was 13, so seven years. So me going to high school, yeah. So seven years, and I mean, I just ended up going that route. I mean, I'm happy with my life right now. I'm actually starting to look into weird, but like Rastafarian and Buddhism is like, I don't know, I guess I, the way I think, I just like being in my head more, like meditating, I feel good, you know, it just, the whole Christian thing, I'm not like trying to diss it, but I guess I know that's the religion that I, can't, that I know most about, and you know, I know about its flaws, you know, more than what I kind of, then I'm not trying to start an argument of, or if whoever's watching the video or anything, if anybody watches it, but it's just my beliefs and what I've read and came across and researched myself, I just, I just believe, sort of, I just believe Jesus was, he was a man, he did exist, just not the whole God thing is, you know, even in the first, I can't like quote exactly where I'm from, but there's two versions of the Bible, and the one that has, the, I guess, the first commandments is the one, yeah, that if I'm trying to remember it right, that I read, and it is completely contradicting, like, at the when Jesus dies and after being on the cross for like three days, uh, he renounces his faith on the cross. It says that, I just have to go back and figure out what book it is. I'll put it somewhere else, but he renounces his faith before he dies in that version of the Bible when they rewrote it. Uh, I mean, it just, it just, it just, I'm just, just whatever makes you happy. It just, I figured out in the long run, Christianity and making happy. And now, now I wasn't going to jump into some really other religion that I really don't know that might not make me happy as well. So I'm pretty much at the stage where I'm just at a standstill, I guess. I mean, I'm happy with being agnostic, I tell people. Atheist, because like, I just I consider religion completely confused. The only reason religion exists is because we think we die. Nobody's positive. We just know 
at a certain point in time in your life, you can't communicate with your loved ones anymore. Like, they lay down and close their eyes and you can't talk to them anymore. And it really, that's depressing, you know, and we assume it's a bad thing because you can go into that state of body in extremely bad ways, you know, and the ways that we can go into that, what we call death is scary, so, you know, you don't want to stop breathing, that hurts, you know, and that's pain, that's emotion, things we name, words we come up with for stuff, and it fits in our everyday way of life, so we don't deny it, I mean, Personally, I don't know what happens if I die, when I die, or whatever, you know. I would know. I know one day I'm not going to be here anymore. I just don't know what happens afterwards, you know. I just find stuff confusing. So, I mean, when that day comes, it comes. But they're just some of my views. I don't know. Looking for other people's opinions on it, you know. You just leave a comment or whatever. And, Oh no. See.